Happy holidays. today is saturday i don't think y'all see my hair like this before i know y'all seen it back in the puff but i just put it like this because i am on the way to my hair appointment i'm gonna get a silk press by my friend zaria that girl is a licensed master cosmetologist now i don't know if i'm gonna record if i do record i'm going to put clips in but if i don't record y'all just gonna see my silk press after footage for y'all so i put it in the video but this is how my hair ended up looking she actually had curled it but i was looking a little bit too, too much like little bill so i was like no so i straightened it and now i'm gonna go out with my mom and see the christmas lights. so i'll see y'all when i get there all right y'all we finally made it up here they got Rudolph, some little carriages over there, those things. And then over here, oh, I thought that was Rudolph, y'all. That's just a little dog airplane. And they got some stuff over there. Boom. They got a Grinch. They also got another Christmas tree right here. It's pretty nice. Happy holidays and Merry Christmas. Today is the day after Christmas, so I'm finna go ahead and go to Dollar Tree. Then I'm gonna go to Publix, just make a couple runs because all the stores are back open. No, I did not record yesterday. I did get a few things that I wanted, but you know, as you get older, it's like you can get everything yourself, so you don't really ask for that much. You don't really know what to ask for. So yeah, it was great spending time with my family and right now i'm about to head into dollar tree just to get a few things i'm also going to be doing my vision board later on in this video so i'm gonna go ahead and get a poster and some things for that and maybe some hygiene essentials but y'all are just gonna come with me so i'll see y'all when i get in dollar tree so i found a poster board aisle i don't need a big one so let's see if they have any ones oh they 50 cents though so i can cut them and just get them let's see let's see i feel like you can't go wrong with a black poster board so we're just going to get a black one i also need dry erase markers so we're going to see if i can find those okay so here goes the dry erase marker aisle I really need the ones with the erasers on it if they have those but it doesn't seem like Dollar Tree has those so we just have to go with these right here chisel tip is this dry erase no I'm gonna have to go with this right here. Actually, I'm gonna get these colored ones. And I guess I can just wipe it off with a napkin or something. So, next on my list, I got a 
We're gonna look for some tape. And then I'm gonna see what they got in here as far as like toilet paper and stuff before I go to Publix, what type of snacks they got in here. So they got Cheerios. That's pretty much the only regular. Captain Crunch. Cinnamon Toast Crunch. And they got Oopsie Berries. Y'all know I love me a good Oopsie Berries. I think I'm gonna get like three of these for right now. And probably like these as well, so. Charms. Oops, I barely get some Cheerios and hmm. Fruit or Cinnamon Toast. We're gonna go with the Honey Nut Cherry. Okay, y'all, Dollar Tree done level up because. They got Red Barn Pizza, the Gordon's Fish Sticks, and at Publix, them things be like $13.99. No cap. And this is only $5, so I'm going to get me one of those. They even got some frozen lemonade ice cream, so let me go ahead and get this. This is the stuff that the ice cream man used to um, come by, and he used to sell those, so definitely gonna get me one of those and then oh that's a supreme pizza I want a regular pizza let's see what else they got I'll go ahead and get some fish sticks just because oh that shit open some fish sticks yeah I don't like none of this stuff honestly Oh, they got bacon. Let's try, let's try Dollar Tree bacon and see what it's hitting for. So they got Farmer John. This look like only four slices. So we're gonna get two, just to try it out. Y'all see? If y'all never shop at Dollar Tree, y'all need to shop at Dollar Tree because these right here, the fruit that be in the cans really be busting, especially the sliced pineapple. So. I'm gonna go ahead and get me one of those. Because these actually be good. Ooh, that one bent. Yeah, we're gonna get this one. And make sure y'all check y'all dates when y'all come to Dollar Tree. Because they really gonna give you some expired stuff. And you're not even gonna know till you get home. Or it'll probably be done dissolved in your stomach. And you don't want that. So. All this stuff is canned goods. And it's pretty much like lasagna, chicken noodle soup, beef ravioli. So if y'all need y'all some of that when y'all sick, y'all can come here and get that. And then this is just like regular waters and juices and stuff like that. So I'm going to go ahead and give me um a Powerade. I can trust a Powerade. Now this drink right here, this brisk, I never had that before. But... I think a lot of people drink that just for some flavor. We also going to get us some toilet paper. I hope it's soft. <laughs> I hope the toilet paper is soft, but we're going to get about two of these just because. And now we on to the next. On to the next, to the next, to the next. To the next, to the next. I found some hot cocoa mix and I'm gonna try that. And also, you guys, I also got some eggnog. I'm gonna try for y'all when I get um, back to the house. But we're gonna see how it tastes. I never had it before, so this is gonna be pretty interesting. So I'm on the snack aisle and I was gonna get some snacks from Publix, but let's see what I can find here. I kind of don't want that much candy, so if they got some good chips, like, I probably would never eat that as a snack. Oh, I used to eat these, y'all, and take those to school all the time. Oh, I'm definitely going to get me some pork rinds, but I like the hot con. So, we're going to get us a bag of these. And then they don't got no Takis. I also found these type of pork rinds. So these are real good. 
if y'all look for pork rinds, definitely go ahead and get you some of that. And I think I only need like one thing of candy. I didn't see no other chips that I had like. Y'all know those candies that used to have different flavors and they were square. Oh, what's the name? Chewies. If y'all ever had Chewies before, Chewies buzz, but I never see them in the store anymore, like ever. And you would think Dollar Tree would have them, but I don't see them, so we gonna have to go with something else. And I think I'm gonna get some Haribo Sour Streamers. These are the best, babe. These are the best. Okay, so this is some better chips. I found some cheeses. You gonna get that? Ooh, I gotta get me one of these. I haven't ate hot fries in so long. I mean, hot Cheetos in so long. But I'm gonna definitely pick up these hot fries because hot fries don't forever bust and then a ruffles and then I'm done. I will pick y'all back up when I find something else that I need. If not, y'all will see me when I get to um, probably Starbucks. I think I'm gonna go to Starbucks. Y'all not gonna see me when I get in public. So I'll pick y'all back up later. As y'all can see, it's raining outside. So I'm on the way to Starbucks because why not try a holiday drink just to get me in the holiday spirit. Y'all look how little Look how freaking little my ponytail is. So, as y'all know, I had went to go get a silk press and she had to chop some stuff off because my ends was splitting up. So, this is what I'm left with. It's not that bad, but this year I am prioritizing hair care. Like I told y'all, I ended up going to Starbucks. It took me 10 minutes waiting on a drink. And it's just like, when I was working at Starbucks, it definitely didn't take that long. I didn't really know what to order, but I was like, go ahead and give me the gingerbread um, oat milk chai, but they was out of oat milk, so I had to get the almond milk chai. This is what it looks like right here, period. That's what it looks like. And I'm gonna go ahead and get me a thumbnail pic. Oh, my phone about to die, but this is what it looks like. Let's see if it tastes good. It tastes good. I don't know if it's, it's, it's the chai or the gingerbread, but it just tastes like too much syrup. It's like too strong. Yeah. I probably won't finish it, but y'all can see like all the stuff that's at the bottom. I don't, I don't like it. I should've got a tall. <laughs> Yeah, I don't like it. Starbucks. The girl was moving real slow though, so she might have been new, and that's probably why it tastes like that. But I'm headed to Publix, and I'll pick you guys back up tomorrow. Yeah, we could just stay away. The things I love about you, I can change. No, 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 no. to go ahead and look up some pictures on my ipad for my vision board and then in this clip right here y'all see me cutting the board in half because it was too big and i didn't feel like i had that many pictures to put on that large of a board <laughs> Just not like that. Your baby was just.
The last clip I'd say was probably the longest part of my vision board simply because I had to insert each picture and then crop it just so that one picture isn't filling up one whole sheet of copy paper. And then here I am using my printer to print out my pictures to later on cut them and put them on my vision board. Go freaking figure. Right when I try to print something out so I can do something that's gonna be useful for me for next year. The ink want to run out so my mama took these out and she was like go to walmart so i gotta get color and black ink like okay maybe if one ran out then we would still have the other but both of them ran out so as y'all can see i put my hair up again here come my little ponytail but at least i can still put my hair in a ponytail because some people can't even do that for one but yeah I gotta run to Walmart and then when I get back, I'm gonna finish my vision board. I have all of my pictures right here. And now it's time to cut it out. And then once I get everything cut out, we're gonna place it on my little vision board. And we'll see how it looks. But as y'all can see, this first one is getting in the gym. I need to get in the gym and get some abs. Cause your girl used to be athletic in high school. I went to college, didn't do nothing. And this one right here say Airbnb. So maybe 2024, your girl might invest in a <laughs> Airbnb or something. You know, it's a vision board. Everything don't gotta come true. So that's what these two are. Also for my um gym, I'm focusing on my glutes. So my abs and my glutes is my main focus when I'm getting in the gym. I don't care nothing about them arm muscles. I don't care about all that. But the glute, baby, <laughs> y'all gonna see. Then here goes my next one. So y'all see it says consistency. I need to be more consistent with my YouTube, with my life, with everything. Like, I just need to be more consistent. I need to be consistent with waking up in the morning, brushing my teeth, making up my bed eating right i got this right here for um optometry i need to get some shadowing in i need to pass my optometry admission test apply for some school so all that optometry related and then this right here another investment that you know maybe could happen it's a vending machine i ain't gonna tell y'all all my stuff that i'm doing but as far as YouTube goes, your girl need to get that YouTube plaque. So your girl need to get her a thousand subscribers before the end of 2024. And that's why I also have be intentional because that's the same thing as consistency. Being intentional about what you're going to do. You need to have a plan A, plan B, plan C. And people will tell you, you don't need to have that. But you do need to have that. If you want to be successful... And you don't want to wait around. You need to, you know, have a plan A, B, and C in case, you know, one plan don't go right without waiting around. And then, most importantly, I got this quote. It says, walk with God, learn from God, work with God, believe in God, and trust in God. Your girl need to get close to God because your girl ain't even been going to church you know in a couple months so i need to get some devotionals pray read the bible listen to some sermons i need to do something because what i was doing in 2023 was not enough and we need to worship um our almighty god so yes now like i said i ain't gonna tell y'all all my you know goals I'm finna make this board, and then if y'all peep with my board set, then y'all peep it. But other than that, those are some of my goals for 2024. <laughs>
And y'all see this 1K cake? Your girl, again, is trying to get to 1K. So hit that subscribe button, like this video, and go watch my other videos and comment on them. Yes, get your girl to 1,000 subscribers. And don't forget to tell a friend to tell a friend about my channel. vision board y'all seeing some stuff but y'all didn't see all of it because i can't tell y'all all my moves that i'm trying to make for this year you feel me so now i got some eggnog so this is southern comfort vanilla spice flavored eggnog non-alcoholic and i'm gonna put a picture of it right here i got me a little shot glass little tiny cup so i'm gonna take um a sip of this if y'all like eggnog, drop it down below in the comments. If y'all don't like it or never tried it, then, you know, drop that down in the comments below too. So I poured me some, let's see. <laughs> Actually, it's not bad. It's just real thick. And I feel like if I had a whole cup of this, like my stomach. <laughs> will be done for like I'd be on the toilet so yeah and that's my review though it is not that bad if y'all want this y'all can shop Publix Walmart or even Target but that is the end of my video I hope you guys enjoy all of my videos for vlogmas this is my first time doing vlogmas on my YouTube channel so I hope you guys enjoy if you haven't watched my other videos Go back and watch those and make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in 2024. Bye. Cause I just want to hear tonight. Oh.